Good afternoon, welcome to the BBC News at One. Detectives in Northumbria have admitted they were warned on Friday that a suspected gunman was planning to harm his former partner and her new boyfriend. That's the day before Raoul Moat shot dead one man and badly wounded his ex-girlfriend and a police officer. We speak to the Business Secretary, Lord Mandelson, who's attending a conference in central London. Afternoon to you. Uh, do you think Gordon Brown's Lovely. comments were, are acceptable? Now, the National Union of Teachers is warning that some schools in England and Wales could be breaking the law by asking support staff to take lessons when qualified teachers are absent. Is it acceptable, given the good-natured conversation they had actually had? The government of Haiti says the bodies of at least 75,000 people have been buried in mass graves after last week's devastating earthquake. Does he understand, you've spoken to him, the scale, the impact that this may have? Good evening. The former Iraqi president Saddam Hussein has been executed for crimes against humanity. Good afternoon. A chilling attempt to cause carnage in the heart of London. A car bomb packed with gas canisters, petrol and nails has been defused by explosive experts. It's 8 o'clock. I'm live in Oxford. Yes, but there's still some hundreds of thousands of people, yeah. up to 300,000, with that running water. Your contingency plans are just not up to it, are they? So it is acceptable from the Prime Minister to call a voter, having a conversation with him about education and pensions, to call her a bigot? No, which is precisely why he said what he did when he called uh, Mrs Duffy. Okay, I can see, you know, this is part of damage limitation at this point. Um, is this typical, though, of Brown behaviour? Private with colleagues from one face we had when he was talking to her, quite another when he was in the car. That is the fear, isn't it, from many members of the public, others, that this is the case. Do, do you know the Prime Minister? Do you spend a lot of time with him? You do. I do, indeed. And I know the truth. 